Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we discuss the following question which says in the given figure the bisectors of angle Q and angle R meet in a point P. If angle T is equal to 80 degrees and angle S is equal to 80 degrees find the measure of angle RPQ. Before moving on to the solution let's recall the facts that the sum of the angles of a quadrilateral is 360 degrees and the sum of the angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. This is used as the key idea for this question. Now let's move on to the solution. We have the quadrilateral STQR In this we are given angle T is equal to 80 degrees and angle S is equal to 80 degrees. It's given that QP is the bisector of angle Q and RP is the bisector of angle R. Now in this quadrilateral STQR we have angle S plus angle T plus angle Q plus angle R equal to 360 degrees since sum of the angles of a quadrilateral is 360 degrees. Now we know that angle S and angle T are given of measure 80 degrees so we substitute these values for both the angles in this equation so we get 80 degrees plus 80 degrees plus angle Q plus angle R equal to 360 degrees this gives us 160 degrees plus angle Q plus angle R equal to 360 degrees so from here we get angle Q plus angle R equal to 200 degrees. Now dividing both sides by 2 we get half of angle Q plus half of angle R equal to 100 degrees. Now we know that QP is the bisector of angle Q. So half of angle Q can be taken as angle RQP plus half of angle R can be taken as PRQ since RP is the bisector of angle R. So we have angle RQP plus angle PRQ is equal to 100 degrees. Now in triangle PQR we have angle RPQ plus angle RQP plus angle PRQ is equal to 180 degrees since the sum of the angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. Now from this equation we have angle RQP plus angle PRQ equal to 100 degrees. So we can substitute this in this equation. So this gives us angle RPQ plus 100 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. So this gives us angle RPQ is equal to 80 degrees. Thus, our final answer is angle RPQ is equal to 80 degrees.
So this completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution for this question.